Hi, um, I'm starting to learn about library overrides for Blender, and I'm running into a bit of an issue with um, this file that I'm working on, which I was hoping to have some help with. Um, so, just to describe, I have an asset here that has this clay material set up. Uh, right now, this is local to the scene, so this isn't a linked material, but um, what I want to be able to control when I eventually link it in is to be able to have this uh, mapping so that I can change like the scale of this material that, that I've got assigned here. So uh, what I'll do is I'll switch over to my other blend file, so Blender Material Builds. And then this has you know, the same sort of clay material um, that I've got going on here. And then if I go back to the um, the asset that I'm working on, so instead of using this, I'm going to link this material. So that's you know that Blender file that was uh, showing you earlier. I'm going to link my clay map and assign that. So now I have this um, linked material assigned to my asset and I wish to do a material override. So I'm going to go down to Blender file here, jump down to materials, right click on clay mat and add a library override. Okay, and so that uh, allows me to edit some of the, uh, the features here. And the problem that I'm running into is if I change something here, so I'll change uh, the metallic from zero uh, to one. I can do that, but if I then save the file and um, reload it, uh, it gives me this little message here, and it resets my value back from you know, one to what it originally was. So this is the value that came from the linked library. Uh, same thing here, if I were to remove the base color, um, hit save, and reload it, it's just gonna re revert to whatever the, the linked file was. And as said, what I eventually want to do with this is to have that sort of mapping node here so that I can uh, alter the scale of my um, my textures. So if you have any uh, suggestions on what I can do to add a material override and then have those overrides be maintained after I save it and then reopen the file, that would be really helpful. All right, thanks so much.